And he said that which cometh out of the man that defiled that man, for, for from within out of the heart of men proceed evil thoughts. It's more again. I welcome you to my channel. Um, please subscribe, leave me a comment, share. When the enemy fails to get you in actions, he will use your thoughts, patterns. That's why we have to be careful. He will use, he will distract you from reading the scriptures. He will distract you from prayers. He will distract you from even going to church or whatever call you have in your church, whatever calling that you have. He will distract you from doing that. And he will also, he can distract you from serving your family um, in whatever that you'll be doing. So, okay, when you read from Mark chapter chapter 7 verses, from verses 20 to 23, it, it says that, And he said that which cometh out of the man that defiled that man, for, for from within out of the heart of men, Proceed evil thoughts, adulterers, fornication, murder, theft, covetousness, wickedness, deceit, lavishness, and evil eye, blasphemy, pride, foolishness. All the things, all these evil things, come from within and defiles the man. The, the man, yeah. So Satan will try to use these things to drive us away from our purpose. Be aware when he fails you, like emotionally, when he fails you. In spirit, he will try. If he fails you in action, he will try to defile your mind. He will try to defile your thoughts. Let us be sober not to defile our minds. Let's protect our minds. Let us be sober. Of, and I mean, let us be aware of his traits. Confusion is not for God. Desperate is not for God. Name it all. It's not for good. Hebrews chapter 12, chapter 12 from verses 15 to 16 to, 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 to 17. It reminds us um, that looking diligently, let any man fell of the grace of God, let any root of bitterness springing up trouble you and thereby many be defiled. And also 16 says that let there be any fornicator or profane person as Esau who or for one most sell of meat sold his birthright. For ye know how that afterwards when he would have inherited the blessings he was rejected for he found no place of repentance though he sought his carefully with tears. So let's stay awake. Let's stay awake. Let's be sober in case you fell of his traps. Let's repent because that's our nature as human, and Jesus is aware of that. Let us repent if we happen to fall of his trap. But at least the devil, you know, I mean, the enemy revealed is an enemy defeated. Thank you for watching. Bye.